So we have to be careful because the real scientists, they will tell you, listen, we work just inside the universe, yeah? But we don't go say there's no God or, you see what I'm saying? That's one of the scientists, he was 50 years atheist. Then he came, he became a God believer, no Muslim or Christian, but, huh? Out the field, yeah. He said, he said, one thing confused me. He said, okay, for the sake of argument, this universe came randomly, yeah? What about the law of the universe? Who put that law? The physics law and the... Why there's a law? Why the sun has to come before the, 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 the moon, then the moon comes after, then there's an order. That's why um, Abu Ayyad mentioned a good point where he said, he said the truth that the prophets and messengers came with, everyone can observe it. You cannot manipulate it. Why? Because Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala guides us to reflect upon the creations of the heavens and the earth and to reflect upon his legislative yeah, science but, and the sunnah. But the, the truth that the scientists claim to have, the only people they can analyze it, them. You can understand. They tell you, yeah, Darwinism or, or uh, what they call it, evolution is, is a fact. How? I got science explained to you. So you're a blind follower. That's why there's no worse. There's no more blind follower like that. Atheists who are laymen, blind following Richard Dawkins, Stephen Hawkins, and Sam Harris, and Lawrence Krauss. Lawrence Krauss is a liar. He said, Universe came from nothing. Then he told him, No, it came from the law. Well, physical law. So you tell me, one plus one will create the creation. Yeah. Two minus two is going to create me and you. It's a joke, Akhi. So those, what they are pushing, Akhi, the media, the mainstream media, are pushing the atheist uh, scientists. But they will, not, they will not show you the Muslim scientists or the Christian scientists. Why? Because go against agenda. You see what I'm saying? Like, in order for you, like when you tell them, okay, what is science? Science is collection of, of data through observation, observation then uh, no, no, through experimentation, and you have to observe it, then you come to a conclusion. Correct, Akhi? Okay, so that's the, the method. In order for you to say scientifically proven, he has to go through this method, yeah? So give me an example when we observed one species evolved to completely different species. We're not talking about adaptation. Adaptation is not safe. Because we can't observe adaptation. But we're talking about something completely evolving to something different thing. They, they, what they tell you? No, that's happened billion years ago. So you're a believer that you believe in the unseen. No. They say we don't believe in the unseen. They believe in the unseen. Because what is the unseen? There's two types of the unseen. There's the unseen, which is the future, yes, or the unseen, the, 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 like uh, the malaika, and the al akhir and jannah paradise. And there's the unseen, which is the restricted one, meaning that you you don't know what uh, Abdurrahman Libi is doing, but Abdurrahman people around him they know. It's unseen to you, but it's not there. And there's the unseen of the past. Because you were not there. That's from the ghaib, as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned. Naam? So, they believe in the unseen. They believe something happened billion years ago. So you never observed it. By the way, they push in universities. That's why the Muslims, Akhi, will lie, the Shabab, the Muslims here uh, in the West, even Muslim countries, Akhi, will lie. We have to make the effort and they have to learn. Because the way people are pushing science and this Darwinism or evolution as something is a fact. If you go against it, it's better for you to do. So, even some Muslims, if you, they say, you know, no, Akhi, go and guess the angels or have some doubt about the angels' existence, but don't even have a doubt about Darwin. Theory. That's how they make it. Evolution is a, it's not a it's kind of, How on the earth we've been here thousands, so there is no human being for him. So there is no one. It's a time for him to evolve to something else. Why we have to stop as human? Yeah, why? Why we have to stop as human? Sheikh Fawzan he said that we never heard because Akhi, what we have to understand, let us analyze what is randomly. Randomly meaning anything can happen, correct? But when you put when you put because Akhi, what they do, they play with words. Okay? This atheist, they play with words. They say random, by chance, random something. Selection. Random How is a random selection? Selection, that's contradiction. Because random, when you choose something without you selecting. Selection, by definition, when you choose something carefully. It's a, it's a factor, yeah, the index. Yeah, no, you analyze it, so you choose it. Like this iPhone, other phones, so I'm selecting which one. Random, I'm just going like that. Yeah? So random selection doesn't make any sense. Yeah? So let us understand by chance or random. If a random, anything can happen. A woman can give birth to chicken. She can give birth to rats. Because why? Random, random, anything can happen, correct? But they say, no, no, we don't mean that. 
So what do you mean? Don't tell me there's microwave, then you bring me fridge. <laughs> no, I'm asking the microwave is a microwave, fridge is a fridge. So what do you mean by random? That's what they play around. That's what Ibn Taymiyyah mentioned, that there's no atheist, there's no atheist in the real life. Because why? Everyone, what they do, instead or what they do, they remove the attribute of creation from Allah and they give it to matter or to energy. So who is their God? They create the energy or the matter or uh, one plus one. Numbers. You see, subhanAllah. So they cannot escape from creator. Something like yeah. Subhanallah. But which one makes sense? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Because when you see like a camera here or an iPhone, and I tell you, look, when you analyze the iPhone, it has program, menu, you can see clearly there's wisdom behind it. Like for example, if I tell you this iPhone, like my iPhone, let me give example about my iPhone. This iPhone was made by someone who had no ability. He was completely paralyzed to make the iPhone. You tell me, no, it doesn't make any sense. You need what? Ability. Okay. He had, so the one who made the iPhone, he had ability, but he doesn't have knowledge how to make an iPhone. Would he be able to make iPhone? So you just put them all together on iPhone? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No. What do you need? Knowledge. He has a knowledge, he has ability, but he doesn't have what? A free will. No, you need a free will. So this is a small scale. What about on the larger scale? The heavens and the earth, you and I. Look to our creation, Akhi. Wallah, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, وَفِي أَنفُسِكُمْ أَفَلَا تُبْصِرُونَ Within yourselves, there is a science. That's what the Quran, Akhi, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, إِنَّ فِي خَلْقِ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَاخْتِلَافِ اللَّيْلِ وَالنَّهَارِ لَآيَاتٍ لِأُولِ الْأَلْبَابِ لَذِينَ يَذْكُونَ اللَّهَ قِيَامًا وَقُعُودًا وَعَلَى جُنُوبِهِمْ وَيَتَفَكَّرُونَ فِي خَلْقِ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ رَبَّنَا مَا خَلَقْتَ هَذَا بَاطِلًا سُبْحَانَكَ فَقِنَا عَذَابَ النَّارِ رَبَّنَا إِنَّكَ مَا تُسْخِرَ النَّارَ فَقَدْ أَخْزَيْتَهُ وَمَا لِلظَّالِمِينَ مِنْ أَنْصَارٍ Allah said within the creation of the heavens and the earth and the alteration of a day and night it is what? Sign. Signs for people understanding, people intellect. Because of course, when I see the sun and the moon, you and I look not nose next to our mouth, eyebrows above our eyes. We can speak, we can understand one another, we can communicate. The indicator of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. You know, there is Allah is so Hakim Ali Mahi, Azizun Qadir. You see. You tell me energy. We say define energy. The energy has been defined by the, the, all the physicists. According to the book of physics, energy is ability to do work. Are you taking the mix? So ability to do work create. Ability to do work doesn't even exist in the real life. It has to exist in something. Is that like you telling me I saw knowledge walking the streets? <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? Oh, I see Shamsi's power. Shamsi's power walking the streets. Yeah. Well, this attribute has to exist in something. You know, playing with words, Akhi. That's why my advice, my brother is recording to my Muslim brothers out there who goes to you in the college. Don't think this science, because there's two types of science. There's hardcore science, which is like making a uh, wash machine, making a plane. That's Alhamdulillah, understand? But there's this uh, fake science with the art, talking about universe, black holes, this and that, and the Muslims just blind following. Rather, we see some Muslims are trying to use this science to prove Islam, which is his flaw. But there's another thing they're trying to differentiate between distinguish between science and Islam like both of them they can't do it. No they can alhamdulillah they can because some science things yeah we do accept naam. but science is as I've mentioned and if you want to go back to my brothers out there even you there is a website called about atheism.net by Abu Iyad this brother who wrote the book here this is Islam so he has uh, Abu Iyad Amjad uh, so you go to his website look he has many websites I guess extremism so take his book okay? go to his website called about atheism.net especially from Holland and you say there's no atheists there you learn Akhi yeah Akhi so what you have to have in first because atheism Akhi Argument we saw the person who made the car, so therefore, if you've never seen him, you, you think the car came randomly. Is that you, someone knocking behind the door? 
because you cannot see him, therefore, possibly, the door is locking by itself. That's the logic, Akhi. Wallah, if he's a Akhi, I will say it. Stupidity. Foolishness. Wallah, Akhi, I think, me, myself, I'm thinking. I said, when I look at I'm walking the street. That's what Allah told us. Reflect, not just to you, to me, to the Muslims, to the Christians, to the Jews, to the atheists, to the Hindu, all of us. Reflect, look. Look, there is an old Akhi. You can see this universe be kept, being taken care of. Because randomly, Akhi, things happen. You see what? S uh, sun going somewhere, the moon going this way, the stars going that way. S <laughs> chaos. You see? As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala mentioned, Am khuliqu min ghayri shay'in, amum al-khaliqu, am khalaqu al-samawat wal-ard bal la yuqinun. So this is my advice to you, my brothers from Holland, that you go back and study these books, ikhwa, because you have the truth to do. Give da'wah. Because even some Muslims, akhi, they've been, the, been brainwashed in, in the universities, in the West, and college and schools, that don't go and get science. Naam? And there's many, even, even now, even in the West, the non-Muslims, they are not seeing that science has been misused big time by the atheists. No, no, any atheists, hardcore atheists, those uh, militant atheists, like Richard Dawkins. Richard Dawkins in his book, yeah, Watchmaker, or something like that, yeah? What was it again? Because I read it, you know, subhanAllah. He's mocking a brother, he said, you believe, even though, there's no hadith said that the Prophet flew on a horse to the seventh heaven. No, no the hadith doesn't mention that. As the Shaykh Sahasha mentioned, the hadith that, that uh, the, 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 the Barak, Barak it was, the Prophet traveled by it from Mecca to Majd Aqsa. Not from Majd Aqsa to the seventh heaven. That was something else was used. Nah? So he's mocking the Muslim. He said, You believe the Prophet flew on a horse? to the seven heaven. The Muslim, alhamdulillah, he said, yes, I believe, because I believe in God and believe in miracles. But guess what? Richard Dawkins, he said in his book, because he believed that this universe can have anything, he said it is, it is possible that a cow can fly to the moon. This same guy who's saying is mocking the Muslim. In his book. And I will send it to you, the book is online, PDF. You can read it, it's there. But I'll tell you, you're the same person who believes this universe came from nothing. It's like you believe you have no money in your pocket and you give your father 5,000 pounds. Yeah. But you have no money at all. You're broke. Yeah. That's why you know Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala tell us to reflect. That's why the truth that we have is universal. The truth that the militant atheists have, they manipulate it. Because they say, there's evidence, but when you tell them, okay, let me look at it. No, 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 you cannot. Because you never study. Let us read. Trust us. You trust you because you have qualification from Oxford University, they have to trust you. Maybe you're the biggest liar. And what is one thing Abu Iyad mentioned? Very good point, Ikhwa. You know, scientists, Akhi, yeah? I'm not talking about every scientist, some of them out there, they are honest. You know, but I'm talking about these militant ones. Militant ones, yeah, the, the likes of Richard Dawkins, Sam Harris, and other than them. Akhi, remember these scientists, they come in with the agenda already. So when they enter to the science circle, they come with the agenda. For example, if I have an agenda, there is no jacket on the earth. Jacket doesn't exist. You see, you see what I'm saying? So now I'm studying and I come across jacket. Because I already have an agenda, I have a belief there's no jacket ever exists. So I will say, no, no, this is not jacket. This is a bag. And because, so I start explaining it away. These guys, they're coming with the agenda, atheism is the truth. So whatever proofs they're going to come across, which indicate there is a creator, they will explain it away. For example, Richard Dawkins, when he did, they, they debated in one of the universities, I believe in America, he said, uh, he was talking about the fitrah, he said, even my colleagues, when you look to the universe, somehow you want to worship something. It's designed. Then he said, what? You think it's designed. It seems it's designed, but it's not. You know, like illusion. You think it's designed. Even one of these uh, atheists and Arab world, the foolish one, when they told him, look to the universe, how there's order. He said, Stephen Hawking, they said, Stephen Hawking said there's no order. So Stephen Hawking said there's no order, you have to believe him. So if there's no order in the universe, how come the sun always rises and, uh, rises and sets? If there's no order, as I have mentioned, the sun is hitting the mountain, the star is hitting the earth, the earth is going somewhere. You'll be random. You'll be random. Anything is happening, my brother. But the fact that you see what? Order. Clear cut. But again, what are you doing? They are blind following the scientists. So we have different shape between the two. There's science which they would making planes, making cars, making this, making that. And yeah, yeah. And there's science which that which they would universe, okay? There's a lot of lies. A lot of kadib, okay? Wallahi, a lot of kadib. Yes, yeah, they've been to the moon. How come we don't go back? <laughs> to the moon, brother. What moon you been to? <laughs> and especially in Arab world, okay? And they say, you, you watch it. 
In BBC News, they say this. You know BBC News? As mashallah, wahi. Yeah. They don't know BBC News have agenda to lie as well. Naam. Or Fox News. Or ITV. So you know, no, they said it, Akhi, ITV News. You know our, our countries. You know, we say, what? what's that mean? No, but even if we look how they start pushing this in their movies. See what I'm saying? Who are the heroes? Them. Rombo. Rambo he fought Angus the Civil Soviet Union by himself again. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> like, the whole Soviet Union, Rambo beat them up. Yeah, okay. What I should show you that not just no one except us in the West. See what I'm saying? Okay. So we have to be careful. We are just, there's out there in the West good doctors, good this. But again, they are misusing science big time. And I mentioned Ikhwa, even people out there who are watching, go back to the website of Abu Iyad, Malah Preserve him, about, about atheism.net. W W uh, three at dot about atheism dot very good Akhi. the way it breaks it down Wallah it's much very very good Akhi, Alhamdulillah you know the fitra Wallah my daughter yeah I said let me test my daughter I said to her, who created a creation she said God I said okay I said uh, I said uh, I said Aisha if you see phone on the floor what do you think I said someone dropped it. I said no, maybe came around the room. said no, 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 no. Someone dropped it. She's six. Why? You know, there's, there's certain things that we learn. You know what it calls? It's called that already yet. You learn, you, it comes part of your nature. For example, two contradictory things will never exist at the same time. Meaning, Shamsi, I'm a, you claim Shamsi is in the speaker's corner. At the same time, it's not. Doesn't exist in the real life. Ma'roof, Akhi. You cannot twist no one's brain to accept that. It's one known by nature. You see what I'm saying? Constructions exist. Yeah? For example, as well, when you see a nice house designed, naturally you know it's been made.